Welcome to our channel Tech Curry. In this video we will learn how to set up Arduino IDE for ESP8266. Let's get started. In above video tutorial we learned how to install Arduino IDE in Windows 10 and how to set up it for Arduino Uno. Now we will set up our Arduino IDE for ESP8266. So let's open Arduino IDE. Now we will got to board option in tools menu and try to select ESP8266 board. But there is no such board listed in the long lists of boards. Let's try to add it from boards manager. In search bar type ESP8266. But we didn't get any result. That means we are missing something. Let's complete that missing step now. Select Preferences option from the File menu. In Additional Board Manager URL option type the following URL. I will provide URL in description section of this video. So that you can copy and paste it here. Click OK. Go again to Boards Manager and search ESP8266. We have found the board now. Let's click install button to install it in our Arduino IDE. Installation can take a couple of minutes. Close the board manager when installation is done. Now select your board from the list of ESP8266 boards available under board-ESP8266 board submenu. I will select node MCU 1.0, ESP12e, because I have ESP12e model. Now check the port option in tools menu. It's showing COM1 port only. Now open Device Manager by pressing Windows plus X keys and clicking Device Manager. We see here that only one COM port COM1 is here, which we also saw in our IDE. Now let's plug in our Node MCU with our machine using micro USB cable. Now we can see that a new COM port USB to UART bridge COM4 is installed in our machine. We will now select this port in our Arduino IDE. We selected COM4 port. Now we are ready to test our Arduino IDE and ESP8266 board. We will select Blink example for our ESP8266 as shown in this video. This sketch blink the built-in LED available in the Notum who as explained in the sketch. Let's flash it without any delay. The sketch has been compiled and uploaded in our ESP8266 board now. Now it's time to see the output. Now you can see the built-in LED blinking. If you see the same output in your board also then you can be assured that your Arduino IDE is properly set up for ESP8266 boards. Good job. Happy coding.